So the difference between me and Emma Chamberlain is this. The blue one. I don't live alone. I actually live with, how many people do we live with? Nine? So, you need a towel, babe? Come here. Anyway, as I was saying, I don't live alone, so I have many distractions, and I feel like her vlogs... I'm coming in, I'm coming out. I feel like her vlogs just consist of her doing whatever the f*** she wants and she's always alone but the thing is is i'm not gonna be alone because are you coming in like i said i live with nine people so Gigi, you coming in there's gonna be a lot of that Gigi? graham don't worry about him he's being dramatic you want to come in now stay in with you i'll talk to you when this isn't going on so like tonight i guess just kidding i'm being dramatic This is our last shot. These are the best pretzels ever. Here's our last shot. I'm having a good avocado. Pray for the best. You're lying. You're lying. All the other ones were black. Okay, so I wanna make a fun little cucumber trick that I learned on TikTok. Homegrown these are, by the way. I love not being able to find my peeler. I guess I'll just have to leave the skin on it. Whatever. Pretty good, I think it could use some lime. I think we're gonna go with some lime real quick. Could definitely use some of this. Okay, let's see. Mm, much better. I feel like this everything mix has a little too much rye though. I gotta taste too much rye. It's weird because I bought this from a bagel place that I literally only go there for their everything bagels because like the bagel is like okay, but the everything on it is just unreal. Never found an everything blend like that before. So I bought their everything blend and it's, it doesn't taste the same. So I call bullshit. Mmm. If you hear the band upstairs, that's the baby. I need to put away some clothes. My room is a catastrophe right now uh not a catastrophe just messy i need to water my plants bad like i'm looking at them and it just honestly looks like they're begging me they're like begging me to water them I really badly need to find a new spot for this plant. So reason for it being in the window is that the more sun they get, the more purple their leaves turn. But the sun, is there something on my lens? But the sun is burning these poor leaves. So I have to find a new spot, but like it's big. I don't fucking know where I'm gonna put this. Yeah, I know I said I was gonna water my amazing plants that need water to live, but I just sat on TikTok for like 30 minutes. I just watched a video of a girl getting E. coli from a milkshake machine at Five Guys. I'm scared to eat out. I'm scared to eat meat. I just watched another video about how these poor animals that are being killed eat literal plastic. There's garbage in their fucking food. So like meat and and anything from a restaurant does not sound appealing, but I actually have no food in my house. So like, I don't know what the fuck I should make. Like actually, what do I do? I, I wanted sushi. I wanted sushi. But do I want to be sick? But is that really gonna happen? I don't know, it could. <sighs> What do I do? I need your help. We still have like an hour until dinner time. Let's fucking water these plants. So the first thing we're gonna do is water this beauty. She honestly doesn't look too good. And she gets watered from the bottom. So that's just gonna sit here. Ooh, I 
just poured water on my cat. Sorry, girly. That was an accident. I definitely have to turn this girl around because she's only growing where the light is. This girly doesn't seem to be doing so freaking hot. I don't know what it is. I mean, she's growing, but the leaves are just floppy. We're recovering this girl. She went through a rough patch. She died almost fully, but she's back in action. She looks so cute. Look. Ah! Now. I need to move you, but I don't know where to put her. Ugh, I, I guess, let me just water it. Let me get my cat from going in the closet. This is Summer, and she loves. She loves. Ooh! My dog. She loves to go in my closet and eat all my plants. Okay, so I'm just gonna finish watering and then we'll worry about our rearrangement here. Look at how beautiful she looks. Think I could be onto something? Like I'm really, really running out of options here. I'm thinking this goes there and then the pink plant goes on there because that doesn't get much sunlight. And then like, is she not getting enough light? I don't know, but I feel like this needs to be in the middle on here. But like, then I have nowhere to put this. And I love this light here. So it's hidden behind the leaves. So I don't like that. No, unless, and that's just fucking ugly. Okay, never mind. Or, no, that's weird. I just picked off a lot of her burnt leaves. I didn't take them all off because she would just look too bare. This is a very emotional transition for me. I'm not sure why. <gasps> I just broke this off. Okay, it's fine. I'm gonna put it in water and it's gonna grow roots. Okay, everyone, end result. We got her here. She's here. I end up liking it. It looks good. She's hanging so low. She is here, which I wasn't sure about because I do have two white pots and then a terracotta, I think it's called, pot. If I'm wrong, whatever. There, but whatever. It's cute. I'm liking the outcome. Still don't know what the f to do for dinner. Now you might be thinking, Rook, what the fuck? But I'm thinking, what the fuck? I just created the best thing ever. Okay, growing up, my mom always made grilled cheese for everyone. I never wanted grilled cheese. I don't like American cheese. So she would literally just grill me bread like this with a bunch of butter. And that was my favorite thing. So I decided, I'm sure, I am so sure that peanut butter and fluff in between two grilled pieces of bread will be so good. Cause it's like the salty and the sweet. And I was so fucking right. Oh. Um, I might have just created a fucking monster. I can't be eating this all the time. It's too good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm not okay. This is what I call a fucking dinner. I went from wanting Italian food to making a grilled peanut butter and fluff. I'm not complaining. I feel like it's very on brand for me to be having my hair in a messy bun if I'm vlogging like Emma Chamberlain. I'm not sure. By all means. I know I'm not as funny as her. I'm just trying to recreate her style of video. I'll never be able to entertain you the way she does. I'm sorry. Beautiful. This is so fucking unhealthy, whatever. Okay. Guys, I just took my hair out of the wet bun after the pool. Obviously, I took a body shower after, but it actually, like, looks pretty and wavy, so. Going to Richie's house with Paul to hang out. I feel like Emma doesn't do really much of an outro. So what I'm gonna do here is say goodbye, and I'll give you, um, her forehead kiss. Here's your forehead kiss from Brooke. Sorry, it's not Emma, but here you go. Love you.